Yeah, it must be rigged. Hey, everybody. Happy Monday. <laughs> Let me bag at back on the Bry winning streak. One. Hey, Dark Passenger. Cyrus, it's good to see you uh, playing in the opening game. <laughs> hey, Scorpio. Um, huh. You all ready for some more Xenoblade? <laughs> yeah, usually you come in about... 30 minutes in with exclamation mark join. <laughs> like, we're not playing right now. What are you doing? Um, that's cool. Uh, yeah, and we saw it. We had a full game. Ew. That's cool. You modded your Switch. Oh, well, that's cool. So now you can pull, put games onto it. Yeah, I don't, you know, I was okay with modding my uh, 3DS because it was kind of like at end of life for it. So I was like, okay, well, I wanted to kind of start doing it. And plus, it was the only way to kind of stream off of it. But I usually don't want to mod my, the current ones. I, I want them to keep them fresh. <laughs> as long as the stores are still available. Anyway, Xenoblade Chronicles, where are we? We're on chapter... That makes totally no sense. The time to mod. When you can replace it. Yeah, that's true. Uh, let's see. What chapter are we on? Seven. You're on chapter seven. We are in the Makna Forest. Makna Forest. And I can't remember what, why we're in the forest. What are we trying to do? We're trying to get to the top. And this is kind of on our way to the top because Sulk had a vision of a big confrontation and it involved the protectors of the uh of the thing. And so, yeah. Yeah, fear fear of Nintendo exactly. <laughs> Nintendo fear is is big. <laughs> Anyway, we're going to be continuing and uh, Justin's probably like, you need to go to Colony 9 and do all this, all the things. Well, we're going to go around here first and then if I feel like I need to level up, then we'll go over to Colony 9 and do some leveling up. Um, but... Number 9? Number 9? I mean, is, nine. is it... Is it, uh, is it uh, a coincidence that it's Colony 6 and Colony 9? I think not. Nice. <laughs> um, as always, we can take a break and play a game off of the arcade machine like Galaga. But it does not have to be Galaga. It can be any of the games on the arcade list that Matthew J put into the chat there by hitting exclamation mark arcade. Oh, in fact, Matthew J wants us to play start off by playing a game off the arcade machine. <laughs> exterminator all right so that's one zab put on uh, on there and it's interesting i haven't figured out how to play it so this will be highly experimental <laughs> one day's seen, for i haven't seen jab zab in a while he his um mother-in-law or his partner's mother uh passed away and so i, I think they've been uh having to deal with all of that well, so my, our, our con condolences go out to him and his and his partner. Say again, Neil. I carry on then. Yeah. So I'm sure he'll be back when he can. Um. All right. I don't think. Oh, you know. I'm sure all of y'all have voted. I was taking a a, a a peek on the votes. But if you haven't voted, you should vote. To help me determine these yellow question mark blocks what games are those going to be pick four your top four games out of that list of 100 games and yeah we'll see we'll see what comes up i was like i said took a peek interesting results some expected not some not expected all right matthew j wants me to play exterminator in our game mode.
Those cats are perfect timed, perfectly timed. All right, so as you can see, you are finger guns shooting or karate chopping bugs. And then it has to do with something with the tiles in the floor somehow. And I don't know I don't know how that works. What on earth is this? Winners don't do you drugs, Neil. That's what it is. <laughs> and look, um, don't do bugs. <laughs> nice. You shoot them with your finger. Yeah. Like, what is what is going on here? <laughs> this is lame. <laughs> it is a weird game. He wasn't just any pest control man. He was the... Exterminator. Exterminator. Look, it's got a skull and everything. Now, why is it a human skull? Why wouldn't it be a bug skull? Because, because he's not exterminating because, humans. Because bugs have excess. Like little poo bugs. Well, and uh, it's probably the skull from the Skull and Crossbones. There, it says when. So, well, I didn't get to read it. Finger gun power. All right. Well, let's let's try and figure it out. Not hearing any audio, so yes, and it really seems like you'd be missing something here. Well, you know, How to fire? I'm so confused with this game so far. That's a good old understand how to shoot. What was, <laughs> what was the score? Everything about this game is weird. It's, it's all dinky. Forty-nine five hundred. I still don't. Well, let me read the instructions at the very beginning because I don't understand how to shoot. Shoot at the side. Rotate it. Shoot. 
shake, shake the joystick. You don't have a joystick button. No. Well, it's, yeah, it's button one. I'm not sure how we're going to rotate. find yourself one of those unplayable games. Now let me let me hold on with the controller here like my nightmare. Not the way extermination works. No, we just have those for real here, the flying cockroach. Beat the high score. <laughs> so obviously, the people, people who made this game were on drugs. One seven fifty. This game's weird. All right, shall we play again? <laughs> That's how the hand goes into the house. This was the first game to use digitized graphics for every element in the game. It 
it was also the last game to be carry the Gottlieb badge. They only ever made 250 of these cabinets. Oh, really? Only 250. Uh, and they were consi they were very unreliable in the field and not very popular with the player. Also, because it was in a very unique cabinet. Which this is the cabinet. Um, operators didn't like it. inflicted this on us. Like, wow. I didn't know he disliked us this much. It's terrible. Wait, have you actually seen one of these, Boy MJ? Oh yeah, the controls were terrible too. I like that there's a picture of the controls for this on this database that I'm looking at. And this machine is like all rusted and faded out. It's been sitting in a cornfield or something. This. this is the cabinet. Yeah. That's where I got the uh, marquee from. No, no, not quite. This seems like the type of game that you play in the arcade. And at the end of it, you're pissed off. You're like, I can't believe I spent my money on this shit. It's kind of how I felt after playing Dragon Slayer.
It's like 165 something. They were very swarmy. Well, you know what they say. He who smelt it, dealt it? No, cocaine's a hell of a drug. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's play one more and then we'll start Xenoblade. This is like the um, watching this game is like watching like an itchy crack addict. Oh, you just watched Cocaine Bear? I don't even remember the last movie we went to see. Is it an animated movie? Yes, it was Mario Brothers. Well, that was animated, so I was correct. are really hard. <laughs> All right, 165, 500 is going to be the high score. Sixty-five, five. Good. It's really no surprise that this would have been the last game from the manufacturer. All right. Let's get away from this game. the soothing music of Xenoblade Chronicles. <laughs> it's got a lot of cooties. <laughs> feel like I need to take another shower. <laughs> oh, we're back to... Oh, the owls are back. Owls are back in town. Somehow, I guess I didn't get all of them. 
or saving didn't necessarily kill him. It's Minato time! Re it reloads the enemies. Maybe I shouldn't have done this. Uh-oh. I see the future. Unfortunately, I just used the Minato. I guess we attracted this one. Did we... we get all of them? I'm confused. I feel like we didn't kill them. Got it.
I fell. Oh, now I fall asleep. Oh, see, we got we exited the battle. Uh, just needed one more owl. One more Hooter. Come back, Hooter. Hooter? Yeah. See these Hooters? What? Oh. The big Hooters. Bodacious Tatas. Yeah, they're Bodacious Tatas. An A. All right. Uh -oh. Did we just activate everybody? <laughs> All right. We need to get out of here. Make a run for it. Come on. Run for the border. We're making a run for the border. Look at all the experience we just got by going to a waypoint. Fa, 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 fa. What is that? <laughs> I'm just looking at you. Monada of power. Level 33, huh? And it's gold. Does that mean it's special? Bucket sauce. Okay, Don't think we're gonna win. Good evening to you as well. It's Ryan time.
Uh-oh. Oh, I got toppled too. Oh, and she died. I thought I was winning. <laughs> welcome! How's it going, everybody? Welcome, welcome. I beat that monster. What were you up to? You were still working on Skyward Sword, eh? Did you, did you beat it yet? Did you beat Skyward Sword? Yay! <laughs> what did you think? Did you like it? Wonderful. That's awesome. Well, thanks so much for the raid. So what's next? What are you playing next? What's the next game? Yeah, yeah. It was uh, playing Minish Cap. I love Minish Cap. It's one of my favorites. Um, I think you'll like it. It's really fun. Um, I was going to say, what was I going to say? Oh, um, the, the motion controls are actually better on the Switch than they were on the Wii. Although, you know what? After playing it, I think I had a problem with my Wii sensor, which is mounted underneath my monitor here. I think I was too close or there was something I was doing wrong that I figured out later, but I was struggling a lot with the motion controls and they were much better on the switch, even though you had to kind of recalibrate them a lot. So. Hey Jess, welcome. Thank you so much for coming in with the raid. All right. Hope shall I do, a, shall I do a clip? Yeah. Oh, so the way that works is it's an accelerometer inside the, uh, inside the controller. Um, where the Wii is actually using the sensor bar. It's a little bit different technology. Yeah, I hope you have a blast with Minish Cap 2. It's a great game. I love it. In fact, I want to say that might have been my first, believe it or not, my first Zelda game, uh, that I played for reals, uh, and I played it on this uh, Game Boy Advance. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here's a clip from Hope June. Y'all should go follow her. Oh, here's Skyward Sword. Oh, we saw this the other day. Like something I'm gonna bring do. that sword right oh, down man. and oh I'm falling off of a cliff oh, <laughs> it is still a good clip I agree it's still a funny clip <laughs> well thanks again for the raid we're continuing our xenoblade quest we just beat a monster I didn't think we were gonna beat hey madbeard how are you doing we're, we're making our way through this forest. I guess we need to go to this path.
What is that? Oh, it's like a bee, but it's got uh, energy things. It's got rings. You seen it? It's got wings. It's got wings. Oh, wait. No, I said rings. It's got rings. rings. There's a bird out there. Another bird. Another level 33. How many of these do we have to beat? Well, if we did it once, we can do it again. The eye says hi. <laughs> yep, you have a, officially every Zelda game. That's awesome. Now, are you going to be playing all of them? Or is it just kind of the collector aspect of it? I think the last one you got which one was that i don't think i played that one because it's a multiplayer game i just didn't consider it one of them, one of them. <laughs> i guess this is not good we're all toppled don't start healing us Attack. Almost there. Uh oh. I don't know what to do with a Tonado spin. Quest complete. We make a great team. Man, what a bunch of jokers. There we go. Don't you don't yeah. Yeah, don't collect for collect's sake. Some people do. But yeah, all the ones I got what was it? The four swords one or something? Oh, Ooh, he's big. There's, I see a mine. Mine icon. Mm, it must be in the water. I don't like that giant frog thing. Oh, it must be up there somewhere. Oh, it is. Okay, up there. Or I probably have to go all the way around. <laughs> yeah, the um, the CDI games are ridiculously expensive and definitely not worth the money. I wouldn't even try collecting. Like I thought about it and then I was like, uh, no. <laughs> Accidentally walked past them. I don't even know what those do. Is that is that part of the So when I collect those, is that part of the gym stuff? <laughs> Intervention. <laughs> True.
Uh oh. Over there. Who that? Hey, are you okay? Got it. Okay. You. The girl from his vision. Uh, Shulk, what's wrong? Another vision? Kind of. I'm not sure. But first, she needs help. You're right. Let's look for somewhere safe. There. I see a clearing under a giant tree. We can easily watch for anything approaching. Okay. I'll carry her. The medic lady. She her hasn't armor sustained is any serious injuries, ridiculous. but her condition is far from stable. Do you know what's wrong I'm with liking her? it. The story is very interesting. Suggest ether deficiency. It's well known that Homs are strongly affected by ether levels in the environment. But I've never seen symptoms like this before. Hmm. A sudden drop in ether content in the surrounding atmosphere causes a reaction. Symptoms range from fatigue to nausea. But in this girl's case... What can we do? We're gonna need <laughs> water-type ether crystals. Charla. I'll load the crystals into the cartridge on the screen to right now. my rifle. Hey, you, You're gonna shoot her? No, silly. I'll fire them into the air and the dispersed ether will heal her. Ah. Uh, that's what I thought. But the problem is the crystals. We can't just use any old crystal. They must be as pure as possible. This area must have a water source nearby. We should search <laughs> there first. I spotted a waterfall a little way back. What do you think, Charlotte? Would a waterfall produce pure crystals? I can't I... think of a better place. Then it's decided. I'll He's like, shock, my eyes are hey, up you're here. Going on your own. I'll be okay. I need you to look after the group. We're short on water, too. So I'll fill up our flasks. Wait, hey, good a... idea. Take care, man. Big and Neil, I couldn't hear you. Is this a clip? Or, or is this Xenoblade? This is Xenoblade. Oh. It looked all of a sudden like a Zelda game. Oh. <laughs> That's the chat. All right, so we need to collect some water ether crystals. And we're all by ourselves. That's, you know, that's safe. Uh, sure, I suppose so. What happens if you fall off this bridge? You die? That's a, that's a far way down. Yeah, exactly.
Hello. Did I even try it? I'll try it later. Try it on the way back. I don't really want to get any, I don't want to attack any of these things because I don't even know which side of that is its face. What's wrong with its face? Let's go this way. Oh. Now I'm blind. That's a good idea. <laughs> the little bugs, not the giant caterpillars. <laughs> when you say, uh, do one of them and you're very non-specific, that's what happens. You know what that causes me to do? <laughs> oh, I totally did not die. Because I landed in water. And you know you can fall from any height and be okay. As long as you hit water. People, people do that on the Golden Gate Bridge all the time. They're fine. They're going to hit water. Um, yeah. We can't hear you. Hear you. That's not true. Yeah. Do I have a full Monado? Well, that's kind of a personal question. It was full when I died. So... Oh, I see why you're asking. <laughs> I said just the tip, Houston. Oh, it's this guy. Hello there. Uh, uh, hello. How unusual. It is quite rare to see a Homs in this region. I... Aren't you a Homs? <laughs> I suppose you're wondering why I am here in that case. Then permit me to introduce myself. My name is Alvis. Alvis. Alvis? Um, my name's... It's Shulk. Isn't it? Uh, how did you know that? Wielder of the Monado, defender of Colony 9, the hero that has every mech on running. You're famous amongst all Homs. I know you from somewhere. From your vision, dude. They're here. Huh? The Monado emits a particular ether wavelength in its ground state. It must have drawn them. Huh? Oh! What are they? Alex, get out of the way! I'll deal with this myself. <laughs> From the left, then I'll go. Oh, 
Yeah, it's been a while now. It can't be. I saw its movement before it struck. How can it? It is a telepia. Telepia. They can read your mind. Whether you have a vision or not, if they know your next move, it's all in vain. You... you know about my visions? How could you possibly...? There is only one way. Stop it in its tracks, then dull its perception. No, Albert, stop! You don't know how to... Huh? A new symbol? That was amazing. I suggest you stop staring. The sword is yours to wield. What was that light? The Monado does not control itself. You control it. I... Monado and they control it. By the light of the Monado. I will stop them. New art learnt. Book Purge. Alright. Using Purge removes a monster's aura and temporarily prevents them from activating another aura. A Telethia's aura, Soul Read, is particularly strong. Use Purge to eliminate it before attacking. Remember to replenish the talent gauge by auto attacking so you can activate. The Monado. Right, so where's... They... Oh, this one does. Behold it. Behold my Monado. Uh-oh. What if I run away? <laughs> uh oh, this is not gonna be good. Ah! I knew I was about to die. Power. Feel my power. Feel my power. 
This is the big explosive one. I don't know how to block. See now, Shulk? Hmm. Thank you. <laughs> hey! Wait a second. More importantly, where on Bionis did you learn to use the Monado? <laughs> they were not the primary Telethia. Merely its spawn. The primary Telethia dwells elsewhere in Magna Forest. Is it wounded? I see. The Telethia is hurt and lies in rest, wounded by a girl. Yay! A girl? The Monado is a divine sword capable of disturbing the very fabric of existence. He's coming on to him. Of both the material his Monado. and the immaterial. Alvis. How do you know so much about the Monado? He's looking soulfully into his eyes. Who are you? I'm on a never-ending quest to save my boyfriend. Shulk! Huh? That's Ryan. Oh. I'm over here! The rest of my triad is coming. Don't worry, they don't bite. Shulk! We looked all over for you. Thought you'd been eaten by the forest. Sorry, Ryan. I got attacked by Telethia. If it hadn't been for Alvis, I wouldn't have survived. Alvis? Who's that? I'll introduce you. He's the one that... Alvis? Diamond? Was... Theodore? Uh, there's no one here. I'm telling you, he was right here. 
Why are they dressed he like even taught me how to unlock a it's new power the armor the they're wearing. Apparently it Just came with tribal really tattoos. Shook. Ain't no one else around. You probably passed out from dehydration and dreamt this guy up. Come on. Wait till the others hear this. <laughs> he was here, Ryan. I didn't dream it. I'm not lying. Okay, okay. I believe you. <laughs> and while you were having fun with your imaginary friend, did you find any ether crystals? Yes. Good quality ones, too. Perfect. Come on. We should hurry some, them back to shore. I got some top crystal. Hang around right. here long enough and we'll get whacked by an imaginary beast. <laughs> hey, I'm looking for Tina. Yeah, I was going to I was going to get it. What'd you say, Neil? Hey, I'm looking for Tina. Alvis. Who are Tina. you? Whatever the bigger guy has on his back looks like it would drag on the ground. An enemy that renders your visions useless. This forest holds many surprises. Not least creatures we've never seen before. And now we know there is another who can use the Monado. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I can't wait to meet him. So you weren't just having a sneaky nap then? No. I'm just saying. You and Dunban are the only ones I know that can wield the Monado. How would this guy know how? Okay, locked and loaded. Everyone, stand back. Unbelievable. <laughs> yeah, she's coming round. All Is that what that medic. means? Are you okay? Where am I? Everything's fine. You're gonna be... <gasps> Get your hands off me! <laughs> ah, hey, watch it! F forgive me. If you work up around I, in the I did not mean party, to... Uh, and sorry if we surprised you. Are you the ones who helped me? Well, something like that. Excuse me. My name is Melia. Forgive my indiscretion. I have not had the pleasure of coming into contact with the male Homs. Coming into contact? Oh, hey, Shulk. You're creeping this lady out. Mm. Shut up, Ryan. This large one is far worse. Me! <laughs> <laughs> Melia, is it? How did you get here then? What, is there no one with you? I must apologize, but my situation does not concern you. And I shall not be divulging anything to common passers by. Duly noted, your ladyship. But if I were to be so bold. I'm guessing that you didn't come here alone, and you weren't just taking an afternoon nap. <laughs> and what, may I ask, are you doing here? It is rare to see Homs venture this deep into Machna Forest. We're traveling to the head of the Bionis. We've got a long journey ahead of us. The head of the Bionis? We were just figuring out how to get there when we found you. I see. Then permit me to return the favor by aiding you in your quest. Really? There is only one path to the head of the Bionis. It is the path that leads to Erith Sea. So, this Erith Sea is at the head of the Bionis? If you would be kind enough to escort me out of the forest, I will show you the way. You... you do that? Thank you, Melia. I'm Shulk. Pleased to meet you. Shulk? Ah, yes. Likewise. <laughs> <laughs> she's a bit high and mighty. But exactly. she's a Holmes too, right? Oh, yes. Why Shulk. is she here alone? Ain't got a clue. Ask her yourself. I'm not good with her posh accent. Oh, does she have a posh accent? Melia the Smellia. <laughs> we shall travel to the Nopon village. Nopon village? That's where we've been heading. 
We reckon it's our best chance of making it to the top. Since inhabiting the region, the Nopon have been a great help. You can travel to Aerith Sea from their village. It's settled. We'll make our way to the Nopon village. Very well. The Nopon inhabit a giant tree. If we follow this trail, ah, we will we be We saw safe. that. Jack-o-lantern? Yeah, <laughs> it does look kind of like a jack-o-lantern. Beware of monsters with spike abilities. From Magna Forest onwards, you will encounter monsters with spike abilities. These monsters can automatically deal damage and inflict debuffs on a party member in certain circumstances. Spike damage cannot be lessened by increasing physical defense or ether defense. The different types counter spike, down spike, close spike. Oh my goodness. Uh, purge neutralizes an opponent's spike abilities for a certain length of time. Spike defense gen. And you're good. Yeah. All right. So, so we just went to, we just. With this? What is the marker? I guess it's this arch. Okay. Okay, there's water. We'll be fine. <laughs> it's Kurt. Hey, go big truck. How's it going? Welcome, everybody. I almost wore, you know which shirt I almost wore today? And I should have worn it. And you, I would have definitely gotten a raid in that case. I have my uh, DJ Kurt uh, shirt, and I almost wore it today. I wore, I wear it uh, when I'm streaming Wednesday. How's it going? What were you doing? Playing Fortnite? Oh, you know what? There's an ad in progress, so they're probably all seeing an ad. Hopefully it's over now. Hey, go big truck. Hey, how's it going? Uh, yeah, I was going to say, I bet you there's an ad playing. Well, thank you for sticking out through the ad. Welcome, everyone. How's it going? How was Fortnite? How was the Fortnite fun? <laughs> yep, Evil Bud's here too. <laughs> I was saying that uh, on I I had a choice between wearing my DJ Kurt Joe shirt or my Star Trek shirt, and I I chose my Star Trek shirt today. But if I would have known you were raiding, I would have worn my other shirt. <laughs> I'll wear it, I'll wear it next stream. <laughs> It's going well. It's going well. It's interesting. It's a very much a different type of RPG. The the attacking is 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 quite different. Neil's not paying attention, but he's. I'm sure he would say hi too. Hello. <laughs> That's Kurt. Neil. Yeah, I know Kurt. Oh, okay. <laughs> I know Kurt's. <laughs> you know Kurt's username. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you, um, can't, you can't fire a volunteer. Yeah. Well, would you mind if I play a clip from your stream? How did Fortnite go? We've had we've had problems with uh it went well. Yeah, exactly. That's true. It is backwards. 
Yeah, okay. That's what everyone says. But then we do it anyway and we laugh. <laughs> Alright, if you're not following, go big truck. AKA Kurt, you should you should go follow him. Like the two of you to do the grand voice. Forgot. Andy. Oh Shannon got a oh. one. Catwoman <laughs> and Marie got a one and Court got five. And there you go. Good job. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't that know what great. accent that was, but okay. <laughs> so you're gonna I? have to ex 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 you're gonna have to explain <laughs> what happened. You have to explain what happened. <laughs> oh, that was from tonight. <laughs> Impersonating another streamer. Ah, okay. Okay, so now we're going to. We're warping around right now. There you go, Gray, who plays Fortnite. Oh, okay, okay. Grumpy Granny. I think I've heard of Grumpy Granny. Oh, more owls. Great. But there's a lot of them. I only want one of them. How do I get one of them? Can I get just one of them? Nope, got two of them. Here, we'll get them to come over here so they're away from the other. Alright, so this is what the, bat the fighting is like in this game. It's kind of like real time. And then you kind of... Oh, now we're all asleep. Well, wake me up. Where you go then? I know. He's absolutely lovely. Okay. I don't. I don't. I don't watch much Fortnite, but I. I will. I will. Uh, I'll check her out. Ugh. And he died. And I fell over. It's not over yet, Dumban. Uh, Me having to carry the team, as always. He's just so damn adorable. Yeah. Alright, well we finally completed that quest. This is why we've had uh, the medic lady with us. I can see this isn't pushing you at all. Oh, thank, thanks, Flaming Baguette. We're adorable too. <laughs> no arms. You're finally able to take two weeks off. Wow. What are you going to do with yourself having two full weeks off from work? Uh, la, 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 la. Change equipment. No, it'll, it'll, it'll get canceled at the. At the last second, it'll get canceled.
That Dunban needs to sit down. Right, he's gonna attack me. He did. He attacked me. This is just one of them. Are you gonna go visit? You're gonna come to the happiest place on earth? Where Woke goes to die. I did switch back to Charlotte. St. Augustine? Uh, not... How far is it feeling, you think? You're kind of cutting in and out. Two and a half, three hours. It's on the traffic. Yeah. Turn down the game a little bit. What's that? Is it a dinosaur with a flame on the back of him? These monsters are weird. We discovered the watering hole and that, uh, that gave us, that leveled us up. Oh no, did that eagle? Oh. I didn't know he was already on the ground. How many? How many of these are we gonna get? Twenty-three thousand in damage. got spikes. Oh, 
Oh, what? What? <laughs> we we were winning, and then all of a sudden we were losing. <laughs> Feel that Monado. Yeah, okay, that's the spike. That was the spike stuff, right? Even though I had just used my Monado power to, to de spike him, it didn't matter. Oh, thanks, Flame Baguette. Alright, we're gonna play some Fry's Quest for those of you who are new to the stream. Rise Quest is our little break game that we play, and it's written by me. Welcome to Neil's and basically, deal. it's an RPG. We're not satisfied <laughs> until you're not satisfied. Up to eight right. players from cool. chat! Exclamation mark! Join, play. And hey, RK Bear. Boo, boo, Ready boo, for boo. I am out of diet coke. Ready for action. Ready for Monado? Ready for some hot Monado action. Yeah, if you played last uh, game, you can join now. Ready for action. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. I used to be an adventurer like you until I took an arrow in uh -oh, the Oh, a gold dragon and a spike turtle. That's not good. All right, I'm going to take a quick break. I'll be right back. Yeah. Ready for action.
ready for battle. Ready for action. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Ready for action. Ready for action. Ready Good for luck. action. You'll certainly need it. Two percent off when you spend ten thousand or more. Ready for action. Ready for action. No refunds. No exchanges. Ready for battle. Ready for action. Ready for battle. 
ready for action. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Get out of here.
Down to one last one. Hey, pass. Good evening. Welcome. survived oh greg you can level up there you go and you got plus nine much better than that five and rk bear got the fry rigged <laughs> all right All right, we're back here. Oh, that's right, we got attacked. I forgot about that. Yeah, okay, we played Exterminator earlier. You missed the debut of Exterminator. It was interesting. Oh, that's right. I forgot about the spikes. But uh, I'll just, I'll keep a, uh, uh, a Monado ready to go at all times. So do the spikes instantly kill you? Oh, did it spike me? Spin. That's how it's not the tornado spin. This is not good. Okay, sure. Got it. This is the Monado. Oh, is that the spikes? No. Oh. Hmm. No, I don't, I don't read messages. 
They don't instantly kill, but they essentially make it almost impossible. Oh, because each time you attack, they kill you. Yeah. The Bonato? Yeah. <laughs> so do I need to go... Oh, well, I didn't know. Did you send me a friend request? I'm an old man. I don't know how to use this technology. I'm joking. I know how to use the technology. I don't know. I Maybe I just didn't see it. Okay. Go to the ether mine. Go to the ether mine. If you would have said it was the Monado mine, I would have been there yesterday. He's feeling it now. He's feeling his Monado. <laughs> it's a Monado. It says I have you as a friend in Discord, Cyrus, so I don't know what you're talking about. The ether mine. Okay. <laughs> oh, are you talking back in the ether mine? Okay. Down that way. I see. So why am I going there? Oh, I see what you're saying. I think uh, you're, you're wanting me to get some, some ether so I can do spikes. Uh, Anti-spike gems. Got it. I'm not so smart sometimes. So was that enough though? Thank you, Bo. Come <laughs> on! 
Okay. So they they re they come back. I think that's going to be better than uh, and then there was some oh let's okay here okay all right so you said take Take a look at my inventory. <sighs> Where? Collectibles. Thank you. Items? Yeah. I have two. Is it the large water crystal? No. There it is, spike defense. A lot of poison. to the falls. The falls. When I want to go back to Colony 9 to turn them into gems? Or are you say, saying I need... Are you talking about down below? One, I don't know what you mean. Are you talking about down on the beach where I met the one guy? Yeah, Alvis. You said the falls. Like, I don't see any falls anywhere. Okay, whatever. Except me falling into the water. <laughs> Look, I'm swimming.
so you think I should go back the other place too? To the ether mine? Oh, this one isn't recharged. Interesting. Maybe there's a little bit of cooldown. <laughs> Who's there? Why does he have so much text there? Oh, he has reconstruct colony six to level one and collect an ultra small reactor. Who's there? We want the spike defense to be all the way up. There we go. How about that? Boom. They're both over a hundred. How's that one? Absolutely mint. All right, that was good. So well, I could just put on I could put the spike defense on my top. Take a look at my top. Uh, let's see. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I should probably do that too. Maybe. Do that. And maybe give her next feature in Fry's Quest adding gems to your equipment. Oh, that's right. I forgot the, the loot boxes were actually next. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> what we talked about we what we talked about having was uh a uh, a smithy that could give you temporary buffs on your equipment that maybe worked one round or two rounds or something like that i always thought that was a good idea All right. Oh, I forgot there's more arts. Seasonal battle pass. There's no battle pass. Oh my goodness. I can imagine having to make constant uh, content for the uh, for Fry's quest. So now, all right, so hold on. The Monado is, so I guess I can't do anything. I can't go to level five yet. Oh, okay. I'm not going to sit here and do I sit, need to sit here and and level her up her shit I can't just do it all automatically I need automatic level up Have a good one, Flaming Baguette. Close to leveling up. Am I now? I don't want 
to attack these guys. I don't like that bird, though. I wonder if I could lo lure the bird away. Okay, so now... Exactly. Another eagle came. Oh, okay. And nothing's gonna stop us. <laughs> Why do you hate America so much? Why are you always attacking the eagles? What did Don Henley ever do to you? Tornado spin. Yeah, that's one way to avoid it. Kill the monster. Well, there's a reminder. If you haven't voted in my upcoming games, vote. I always forget to remind people. Run off into the water. I'm gonna go get that collector there. You know what I haven't done lately? The collectopedia. Hello. 
leaf resist. See, they're just kind of different dinosaurs and they've got different gems on the back. want to go to Frontier Village, it's safe to go this way. No pawn never lies so you can believe me. Oh, these guys are uh, interesting. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I keep thinking we're going to see the uh, uh, Ewoks. Made it.
This is the entrance to Frontier Village. So this big tree is where the Nopon live. Ah, Bird Lady. Welcome back, Bird Lady. I wish to speak with the village chief. Will you permit us to enter? My pleasure, my pleasure. I shall take you to the village chief. Follow me. Where we're at, we're way up I'm near the head. We're almost there. Then we get kicked all the way down to the feet. These things are creepy. They look like Easter bunnies or something. I don't know. Home, home! Home here! Home here! Home who? Home who? Home, home everywhere! Me won't touch home, home! Me won't nibble home, home! Home, home taste! Pew. Home, home scary! Ooh. Okay. Nopan of Frontier <laughs> Village. Melia Antigua has returned. I request an audience with your chief. Chief, will you hear my request? Melia here. Bird lady here. Uh, Melia back. Bird lady back. Bird lady? I thought they... I didn't think they... Oh, hello. My dear Melia. I don't know what I look like when I wake up in the morning. So soon. And you look so well. And what of your men? They are at one with the Bionis. They sacrifice their lives so that I might escape. But this is not my reason for coming. These Homs need your help. Will you be so kind as to listen to their request? What could a Hom Hom need of me? They require safe passage to Erith Sea. I see no reason to deny them. And Melia, what of you? I have unfinished business in this region. Once these Homs are safely on their way, I shall be on mine as well. That girl. Something's troubling her. <laughs> we found her half dead and all alone. But I don't suppose she'll tell us the reason any time soon. Maybe we can help. I'll go and talk to her. Oh, I'm sure that'll help. Bash two Amos or Lugas. Bash three. I almost fell in there. That would have been bad. Where'd she go?
That's it. Oh, what, what was that other thing? Is this how? Any of these? No. Is this? So this allows you to go to level two, basically, or that second set. Mondo mobile, Monado mobile. <laughs> uh, well, let's see which ones. Battle soul. I wish it told. Uh, it reminded me what those were. Is it Shaker's Edge? Nope. <laughs> kind of show you oh i see it it's this one which i don't even have activated <laughs> so maybe i should activate it Shaker. <laughs> Whoops. Which one can I live without? Get rid of tranquilizer. You warp to the refugee camp on the. Oh, okay.
the refugee camp. I remember that. That was the leg. all this and we're just flashing right past it. a lot to buy here. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I just haven't been I've been so I've been doing quests though. I mean, I guess I could sell stuff. Uh Arts. I don't have anything to do right this second. Well, I have stuff I could sell. Why is that locked? Or should I 
I could probably sell. I'll just hold on to everything. All right. Look at this. Why is that highlighted with a star? Oh, it says, wait. Do you know, Chieftain, why that one's highlighted with a star? There does not seem to be. This mar manual has already been studied. Oh. Okay. Well, then why doesn't it say number zero? It should say number one. Yeah, I guess that's maybe that's it. Once you look at it in the arts. That's where we were. One has had way too much caffeine and is vibrating. Did he just say his girlfriend got eight? Oh, look at that. 3,000 experience. Find the flower bracelet in Frontier Village. That's worth three thousand.
<laughs> no way. I don't do what I'm told. And I'm not very good at that. I usually do the opposite. <laughs> exactly. Getting a lot of experience walking through this place. <laughs> well, that's not true. That's going to do, so I'm not going to trade with you. This <laughs> sanctuary. Sanctuary. There she is. <sighs> Melia, you're welcome to come with us. Is it true? Were you alone in the forest? <sighs> that thing must be stopped by my hand. This is my pledge to those that have died. Is it... wounded? I see. The Telethia <sighs> is hurt and lies in rest. Wounded by a girl. Wounded by a girl? You don't mean you're going to fight the Telethia? <gasps> How do you know of the Telethia? When I went to collect the ether crystals, some Telethia attacked me. I managed to destroy them and get away. You defeated Telethia? Who... who are you? <laughs> We've only been traveling together for hours. The Minado. So that sword can... To tell the truth, they were the Telethia spawn. Someone told me the primary Telethia is healing somewhere in the forest. It was you, wasn't it? You hurt the Telethia. It... Melia... The Telethia escaped from our homeland and I am tasked with killing it. It cannot remain free. For the sake of my people and the Nopon, it must be stopped. Melia... We can help you defeat it if you like. Out of pity? No. Why then? It's just... I... I won't. Speak, Shulk. Or I shall be forced to summon the Nopon chief to interpret for me. I... would like to help. What could you possibly gain from aiding me? I saw it. <laughs> At the top of a black tower. You and I were fighting together. Fighting that faced Mekon. I also saw you fighting a huge Telethia. It threw me the first time and all. Forgive me, Shulk, but what are you talking about? Shulk can see visions of the future. See the future? And do you expect me to believe the this future. rubbish? Believe what you want, lady. Same as I tell all the non-believers. <laughs> That'll be me, then. Oh, yeah. In any case, the only reason we got this far was because of Shulk's visions. If Shulk says he saw you in a vision, then you must be important to whatever happens next. And if you're tough enough to fight a face mech on, you're all right in my book. You've got my vote. A lady should not go unaccompanied onto the battlefield. Excuse me? I... <laughs> I am quite capable of dispatching the beast alone. I require no assistance of any kind. My dear, I apologize, but I could not help overhearing. Their offer sounds quite reasonable. The danger extends much further than our small dwelling. Machna itself is at risk. And we shall provide you with the finest warrior of our clan. Oh, great. Chief Dunga, I... Uh, no need for thanks. He is the equal, if not better, of the Hom Hom. 
<laughs> he didn't know we're listening. <laughs> the chosen Nopon hero will await you below. I shall go ahead and prepare him. Please excuse me. Okay. Nopon hero. Now this I have to see. Don't be like that. Let's meet him first. He could be huge. Burr, burr. They all disappeared. Cool potatoes. Introduce Herapon Ricky. Yay, Ricky. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, what's that? Get off me. <laughs> to you. <laughs> right in the Is he a beach ball? Be oh, he's going to spike him. That's good. <sighs> it's so anime. Get 
Why is there a guitar playing now? I introduce to you this year's legendary Herapon, Ricky! <laughs> 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 a hero pond, you say? Not sure where you'll come in handy, but the more the merrier. Sure. Are these Telethia as strong as they sound? Yes. They're quick as lightning and can read your mind. A mind reading giant bird? No problem. I can see their movement through the Monado, but even that's not enough to get the better of them. And we're going up against the daddy <laughs> version. No one blink for a second. Okay. Eyes wide open. And don't forget that Melia is our only chance of making it to Erith Sea. If anything happens to our guide, it's on our heads. The Telethia is our target. But don't forget about the person standing next to you. Dumbans right. I am in your debt. My weaknesses are all too apparent. No worries, Melia. of the Dino Beast, what you refer to as the Telethia. Be safe, my hum-hum friends. Ricky's friends, listen to Ricky. Dino Beast is big and scary. Friends, <laughs> get ready. Friends, help Ricky get ready. You want us to get equipment for you? Ricky's friend, right? Hum hum clever. Friends meet Ricky when ready. Then, friends and Ricky leave together. Big attitude for a furry footrest. Dino <laughs> Beast is big and scary. <laughs> right, that'll come in handy. Is it just me, or did we suddenly become Nopon mercenaries? Just need to collect it. Collect Ricky's weapons from the weapons shop. Collect Ricky's armor from the armor shop. I thought this was for Ricky. They're not all that great. I already have two. I know where the weapon salesman was. I was just there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Ready to go! Come, new friends! Ricky's adventure begins! Ricky, you do know where the Telethia is, don't you? Of course, Ricky, no. Melly, 
Ricky here you hurt Dino Beast. I did, but only a little. When Dino Beast hurt, Ricky know it go <sighs> to place with ether crystals. Friends and Ricky go to place with crystals. Then we find Dino Beast. Chief, tell Ricky. Chief, always right. So you do know a thing or two about this monster. Guess we'll be searching for some ether crystals then. Ricky, why are you the hereupon? Why? Because Chief Dunga chose Ricky. He chose you? So you weren't chosen from birth? <laughs> Friend wrong. Chief choose by instinct. <laughs> by instinct? Why, friend surprised? Chief have sharp instinct. Chief be village seer. So that's how you became the hereupon. Can't argue with that. But he is kind of... compact. For a warrior hero. <laughs> oh, Ricky owe lots of monies to village. If Ricky defeat Dino Beast, village promise to forget my debts. <laughs> so Ricky. He's got a gambling problem. So what happens if we, uh, if we, if we put him in there? We'll give him back attack plus. <laughs> I guess he has arts too, right? Sneaky and bitey bitey. <laughs> yeah. Go defeat big monsters. We'll forgive your debts. Happy, 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 joy, joy. Play dead. Oh, and then he's surprised. He plays dead and then there's a big surprise. Oh, I see. So, say again? So we should be looking at Melia too? You can destroy Telethia. Ah, okay. Well, should I put her in the, uh, in the party too? Like that. Oh. Well, I feel like what we should do is maybe do this. Down there. 
why? Okay. Can I just jump down there? Is there ways to get down there? Hopefully that affected the whole party, not just... <laughs> That would have been a safer way of going down. Would have been much safer. All right, let's play some Fry's Quest. I am out of Diet Coke. Exclamation mark join if you want to join. Otherwise, I will unlock it so anyone can join here in just a second. This gives you a chance to play if you didn't play last round. All right, so now anyone should be able to join. Welcome to Neil Steele's. We're not satisfied. So Greg, if you want to come in, you can. It's now open for everybody. ready for the next level. So now you need three fries to level up to level three. The number of fries required increases. Anyone else? 30 seconds. <laughs> There's only one game that's being played now, Jason. That's Fry's Quest. Closed. Have fun counting sheep. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna take a quick break. I'll be right back.
Welcome to Neil's Deals. Where else you gonna go? See, you're buying a potion. It might prevent death. Side effects might include growing mushrooms and warts Ready and for loss action. of sensation in naughty places. Ready for battle. Shops closed. Have fun counting sheep. Welcome to Neil's Deals. Where else you gonna go? Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Ready for action. I used to be an adventurer like you, until I took an arrow in the knee.
Ow. Oh, how was how was three player prize quest? <laughs> Dark passenger with the fry. They got a, six fries to go. <laughs> well, actually, everyone needed a fry there at the end. All right. So we're not going too much later. Sacrifice half of your HP to fill the talent gauge. I don't know if I like this. I guess it could it could be good in a in a pinch. Yeah. Just to current HP I get. Yeah. So like I said, in a pinch, if you really need it. That giant thing. Holy shit. I saw some There's one. Got spikes. Oh, my. So what were you saying about her? Why aren't 
me a tactic. Why? Is that, why isn't that thing attacking? Oh, can he not? He can't. Because we're in water, he can't fight. I get it. Oh, she can foresee things too. Use it to bait the fish. Is it still him foreseeing it? Yeah, I see. Okay. All righty. I don't like this. This has... Fights. A second. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Saying I can walk over these? Oh, it is. Ah. Where the story continues. Oh, this? Oh, okay. What is this? Ricky never see before. This not Ricky's Machna. Ricky never see before. To think it is causing oh, this was much it? damage. <laughs> what do you mean? Are you telling me that Telethia did this? T 
Telethia absorb and drain the surrounding area of all its ether. That's it. The Telethia is sucking up all the ether, which is causing the natural environment to change. Shulk, the Telethia can read your mind. Expect it to know what you will do before you do it. I know. I'll aim for its antenna and stop its ability to read my thoughts. With the Monado at our side, it doesn't stand a chance. It's much more powerful than its offspring. Do not expect it to fall so easily. I won't. But we have to trust in the Monado. Shulk has only met Telethia once, and they were merely the spawn. So why is he so sure of himself? Is it confidence? Okay. Or trust in something? Yeah, I was going to say, why wouldn't the Monado yes. be in the fight? It is trust. He trusts in the power of that sword. What did he say it was called? The Monado. I see. <gasps> Stick together, everyone! Dino Beast! It is Ricky and Magic! It may be too late. I take this chance to bring vengeance to my brethren and fulfill my duty. Show, I will trap it and cease its movement. Strike when the time is right. Melia! <laughs> oh yeah! She's nifty with that stuff. I knew it. She can control ether energy without using catalysts or rifle shells. I've heard that such people exist. But I never thought she would be one. Shulk, right, Shala. Protect Melia at all costs. On it. Right. Ah! Okay. So you don't think I should control Sulk? Because I'm used to Sulk. That's why I say that. Manifest yourself! Start 
But she's about to get hit. Why wouldn't I? She's about to get killed. Why wouldn't I warn her that she's about to get killed? I don't understand. <laughs> You warned Salk, then you could use his Monado shield. Oh, okay. Got it. You know what? We need to end here anyway. <laughs> You know what? We didn't finish a chapter today. Oh no. I've thrown off the whole timeline. <laughs> I've thrown off the whole timeline. That was probably the boss, right? If I were to defeat, I was, defeat that boss, then that would have been the end of the chapter. So close. Now I have to get up. I have a doctor's appointment in the morning. So I have to, I have to get up a little bit earlier. That's why. <laughs> maybe, maybe something else is going to happen. Which, there have been a few of those where you have the boss, and then, like, a little bit more happens. And then, like, remember uh, Zord? Like, you fought him, and then you pushed him into the thing, and then he came back, right? And then you fought him again, so... Well, thanks, Justin. Thanks, Noel to Live. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Uh, I stream every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday at 9.30 p.m. Eastern. And on Saturday at 3 p.m. Eastern, I'll be back on Wednesday. Wait, it's not Worst Game Wednesday. No. that's Actually, that's not for another two weeks. So. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it's just a, it's just a checkup. No, nothing, nothing scary or anything like that. Just, a, just an appointment. When you get when you get older, you go to the doctor more often, <laughs> just for checkups. <laughs> All right. Thanks for the Monado. Yeah, yeah. We, oh, good night with Monado dreams. <laughs> Thanks, Dark Passenger. Um, thank you to all these people too. They're my subscribers. To get ad-free viewing and all those emotes and my my appreciation. Thank you, subscribers. Thank you for supporting uh, the stream. <laughs> no thanks to going to the doctor more often. All right. Boop, 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 boop. Let's see who we can raid. Oh, 
music is crescendoing. Turn it down a little bit. Ba, 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 ba. Sometimes I'm the only one on. Oh, I'm not. Uh, let's see who else is on. I feel like I'm going to be the last person to play Tears of the Kingdom. There's so many people playing it. How have you been enjoying it, Jason? I think we're going to head over. They may have just gotten a raid, but we're going to raid them again. Uh, we're going to go over to Queen City Q, who's who's playing Resident Evil. Boom. Oh, you know what? I didn't do the raid messages. There's the raid messages. <laughs> I was like, I have no raid messages to, uh, to copy and paste. Thanks again, everyone, for being here. I hope you have a great week. I hope I have a great week. I hope I sleep well. Actually, the doctor I'm going to is the pulmonologist, which is my sleep doctor. Uh, so maybe, maybe I can tell him I'm tired. Fix my CPAP. Anyway, have a, have a good week. Bye, everybody.